Creepy Kentucky in here with you from deadpit.com with another review. It's been a little while since I've done one of these solo reviews. So this time it's a documentary film, uh, not necessarily in the realm of horror, but kind of a little bit. One of my favorite 80s hard rock heavy metal acts of all time is Wasp. And here's the debut album right here. Just entitled Wasp, and I've always followed their music, Blackie Lawless, Chris Holmes, um, a variety of others over the years. Chris Holmes, though, recently had a documentary made on his life, and it is the topic of the review today. The name of the documentary is Mean Man and it recently came out from MVD Visual, Cleopatra Entertainments, and I'm taking a look at it here today for you guys. If you're looking for a good music-based documentary, this is this is one for you. It follows Chris Holmes' life post-WASP and interviews a lot of his close family, former bandmates, um, talk about the infamous scene in Decline of Western Civilization to his life since then, how it's changed, how he quit drinking, and the evolution into his new music projects, which from the documentary sounded like he had gotten out of music for quite a few years and just did some normal nine to five work. He actually lives in France now, married to a woman, a French woman. Over in Europe, it's kind of odd because, you know, a lot of the 80s hard rock heavy metal acts are still sort of a big deal over there. Wasp included. Um, and you can see the back of the album cover here. That one right there is Chris Holmes back in like 80. I think that album was in 84, 83, 84, something like that. Um, this is a badass record, by the way. Original press for that. Mean Man's like a 78 minute documentary. He's crazy. He's still wild. Um, but he settled down just a little bit. The drinking and stuff, I think he had stated that he had, he had stopped the drinking for 20, 20 year sobriety. So that's sort of a big deal. Um, but a lot of, Former bandmates talk about some of the crazy shit that they did back in the day. He talks about his love-hate relationship with the lead singer of Wasp, Blackie Lawless. He signed his songwriting uh, royalties away. Kind of a down-and-out character for a while there, it sounded like Chris Holmes was. So, this is actually a really interesting documentary. Mean Man, only 78 minutes long, but... I'm big into the hard rock documentaries uh, about characters from that time period. So this is one that you may definitely want to pick up. I think it's around $17, $18. Again, MVD Visual or Cleopatra Entertainment. I think Amazon has this one out as well. Um, so you can check it out there. And uh, like I said, it's a quick watch, not very long, but it's fun and... Yeah, it's, it's a fun little documentary. You'll probably learn a thing or two about this crazy ass. It's the story of guitarist Chris Holmes from the band Wasp. So that is it for the review today. Just a really quick one I wanted to get out there. I did want to send a big thank you out to all of the new patrons on our Dead Pit on Patreon.com page. 
Um, this site has grown quite a bit this month, and I really just wanted to thank everyone who has checked that out. We have over 100 episodes of the original Dead Pit Radio Show, over 60 plus episodes of the MySpace Show, about 45 audio commentaries, dozens of exclusive Patreon shows. So it starts at like a dollar and goes up from there. Uh, if you want to check that out, Dead Pit on Patreon.com. I will link it at the end of the video. And again, Big thanks to everybody out there who's been checking our stuff out. We are back. Recently did the Scream Retrospective that is available in the archives here. And we're going to do the podcast version as well. Uh, that's coming up probably this weekend. So, again, I am the Creepy Kentuckian. We appreciate you guys checking this out. More info on everything. Deadpit.com a special thank you goes out to our supporters on Patreon. The Patreon website has a complete archive of the Dead Pit Radio shows starting way back in 2005, in addition to all of the midweek shows archived, commentaries, all that good stuff. If you're interested and we appreciate all the support, go to www.patreon.com backslash into the dead pit. Tears start as low as $1 per month.